Bye. Halloween night, 1963. Six-year-old Michael Myers kills his older sister Judith. He's wearing a clown costume and sporting a clown mask. In today's video, I have a replica of that clown mask. So let's check it out. And I ordered this mask directly from Trick or Treat Studios. If you're looking for a Michael Myers mask for Halloween, uh, Trick or Treat Studios is where you should start. Because their replicas are pretty screen accurate. And yes, it is a replica of the mask worn by young Michael Myers in the 1978 Halloween movie. Although I could not find any history on this mask, I searched the internet for any kind of uh, history on where it came from and who made it. I even reached out to horror expert Sean Clark and he told me that the history behind this clown mask is a mystery. Uh, no one seems to know uh, other than the fact that the production crew uh, acquired this mask and it was cheap. That's basically all uh, we know about this mask. With that being said, if you know any of the history of this mask, uh, do let me know down in the comments because I am interested and before I break out the, the clown mask I should mention that I did purchase two masks so there are there are actually two masks in here uh, and I'll be showing you the second mask later but as for right now I'm just gonna focus on the on the clown mask Ooh, and it's tagged as well. I like that. I'm just going to put this off to the side. Yeah, it comes with the uh, Halloween 1978 tag on there. Which I'm going to be removing. Although I may, no, I don't think I'm gonna re. I sometimes I reuse the tags. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll remove the tag from the item, but place it uh, back on the item to display it here, like I like I've done back here. Uh, well, I've done right here with my Halloween two knife, as well as my uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre sledgehammer back here. I don't think I will be. Uh, doing that here with, uh, with this mask. Just let me get this tag removed right quick. And then we'll talk more about the mask. And there it is. It's got a nice uh, strap on it as well. I was expecting just like a, a sort of a, a thin cheap elastic, uh, elastic band, but this is actually a fairly thick uh, elastic. It's still elastic, but it's a fairly thick one, which is, uh, which is a lot better than what I was expecting. But yeah, there it is. This is, um, technically, I would consider this to be a child's mask, but it, it's small enough to be a child's mask. I'm sure it could fit a child's face, but uh, it does fit an adult's face as well, as you could tell. So yes, this is indeed a replica of the mask that Michael is wearing at the beginning of Halloween. Where we see him uh, pick this mask up off the floor and then it's all about his point of view as he uh, goes up the, excuse me, as he goes upstairs 
brutally murders his sister and if you're not paying attention you might not even notice the fact that the nose on this mask is as long as it is I watch this movie every Halloween I think even this time around I had missed that I had missed the fact that the nose on this was so long you can get a shot of this mask in the movie as Michael is standing there when his parents show up uh, when they pull up in their in their car he's standing there with um, with the mask on and holding the uh, the murder weapon which is just an ordinary kitchen knife that the character Michael Myers has become synonymous with. Michael Myers loves his knife. And uh, although this is one of uh, Trick or Treat Studios cheaper, more affordable masks, I don't think I paid any more than uh, like $15 for this mask. Uh, it is uh, fairly, fairly thick uh, plastic. It's not, um, it's not a cheap plastic form mask by any means. This is actually a more of a quality, quality uh, made mask. If I haven't said it already, I do have a newfound appreciation for the vacuumed form mask, and I've actually uh, ordered. Uh, and pur I've, I've purchased a vintage vacuum form mask that I'm going to be uh, showing here on the channel and uh, unboxing here in the future. And that mask uh, pays homage to some of the other masks that I have here in the collection. And so look forward to seeing that video here in the future the creators of Halloween from what I read were considering a Emmett Kelly frowning clown mask as their first choice for the adult Michael Myers character yes they were actually considering a Don Post uh, Emmett Kelly frowning clown mask. Emmett Kelly was uh, an American clown. He was a real person and uh, I guess his father uh, he was like a legendary clown so uh, Don Post had a, a mask that was modeled specifically after his look and that's and that's what the creators of Halloween uh, had in mind for their for their first choice. Their second choice seemed to fit much better and was much more creepier as it was a blank face and emotionless, much like Michael Myers himself. Well, that's today's video. Just another unexpected addition here to my Halloween collection because I really hadn't planned on uh, purchasing any new masks for the Michael Myers shelf back here for the Halloween collection. When I saw this on the Trick or Treat Studios uh, website and saw that how you know cheap it was, I said what the hell I'm, I'm gonna grab it for the collection. Although I am planning on acquiring the Halloween ends mask when that arrives and I'm hoping that the Spirit Halloween uh, closest to my area will have that mask and I don't have to order it online. I am looking forward to adding that mask here now that I found out that Trick or Treat Studios uh, is releasing one. So. I can't wait to to get it here in the collection and I look forward to uh, to seeing that mold effect on it that I've heard about. I'm looking forward to seeing that because obviously now at this point the mask is 
it, it, it's old and it's 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 taken a fucking beating you know and uh, the fact that they've added mold to it I mean that makes it more authentic and I can't wait to see that up close so hell yeah that's today's video guys uh, thanks so much for watching like always do join me again for my next video until then like comment and subscribe